In this video, we'll show you how to batch adjust interactive margins in Titan Word Add In. What does this mean? Okay, so let's say we've got a Word document here. In here, we've got a table. This is not a Titan table. This is just a standard Word table. And in there, I have one, two, three, four, five, ten fields, and all ten of these are interactive. Now, once you publish this, this is what it's going to look like. So let me just go ahead and pass some parameters in here, and then I'll click Submit. It's going to go ahead and generate the document. All right. But notice how messy all of this looks. Look, it's everywhere. Like. It just looks horrible. Everything's towards the right. That should be, it's over there. That's over there. And it looks messy and ridiculous. And it's gonna not going to be a good experience. So rather than having to move one by one by one by one, how do you adjust all of these in a batch? OK, so let me show you how this is done. So the fields that you see here are essentially coming from here. OK, text box one and then A, B, C, D, E over here like this. Let me show you how you can adjust these. Let's take these fields first. What you want to do is you want to click individual one like this so they're all highlighted at once. Okay, very important. Then what you want to do is go on the right hand side, you got something called interactive margin. And for this one, what I want to do is I want to set this to minus 50. This could completely depend on your document, but for me, I think these are the correct measurements. So minus 50, minus 115, and I'm going to set a certain width, which is 196. Let's click Save, and now let's refresh this document. And then let's see the, the modifications that we've made where these fields have ended up. So here's the document, and look at that. It looks really, really nice now, okay? Everything is super, super good, very, very nice. Titan, form Titan. Titan sign, Titan portal, Titan forms. So as you can see, it looks really, really nice here and good. This is how you do the batch. Now we will do the same for here as well, because this looks really out of place at the moment. And the width is, well, it's, it's terrible basically. So this is how you do it. So again, same process, we'll click on each field individually make sure they're all batch selected then on the right hand side we will go interactive margin I'm going to remove the left margin and I'm simply just going to put minus 50 and the size is going to be 196 now let's click save and let's show you how that change that will save you hours and hours can do if you can do it properly doing the batch uh, interactive. So again, we've done it. Again, looks really, really nice. So here, I can type it in. It looks brilliant. And essentially, this is how you do it. It's a super easy feature. All you have to do is highlight all the fields like that in a batch. And once you've done it, you have to then adjust the interactive margin. Now, word of advice. Basically, minus means it will move it will move downwards and if there's not a negative it will move upwards and same here minus means it will move towards the towards the um, the right and then minus will be towards the left <coughs> and this is how you do it and then interactive size is the width these are the width, width of the fields and after all is said and done it will come out beautifully and uh, and that's batch interactive margins adjustment in titan